I feel a type of way Yeah, I don't know about the real side of story Can't live if it is what it is If I lose it right now Pizza Brasileira Brasileira Ai meu Deus, eu não falo português Oi galera Tudo bem? Now Today We have a video of gringos trying Brazilian pizza Now this video is sort of more to look at the Brazilian pizza and also to see how gringos react to the Brazilian pizza because I am very, very interested with Brazilian pizza, bro, because Brazilians always tell me, bro, that nothing beats Brazilian pizza. Like, Brazilian pizza is number one. And I'm like, okay, 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 interesting, because I would say our pizza in England is pretty damn cool, but I don't know because everyone says Brazil kings of pizza. And I think Sao Paulo is the place of pizza in Brazil. Uh, could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure it is. And uh, yeah, I wanna see the Brazilian pizza. I wanna see Gringo's reactions to it because it's probably be my reaction in a few years. No, in a year, maybe now. Can I have Brazilian pizza, please? <laughs> Anyway, let's get into uh, this reaction. Let's go, let's go. Sorry, oh, chin, chin. I'm excited today. Chin, chin. Oh, chin, chin, oh, this, video, this video is by EWN TV, by the way. Great channel. Mwah. Move the bomb. Saúde. You guys ready? Absolutely. Oi, lindezas. Vim aqui pra casa da minha aqui. E eu não falo português, girl. Ai meu Deus. Ah, sh... Querida amiga das amigas, Shai, que vocês já conhecem, respeitam e admiram. E a gente vai pedir umas pizzas brasileiras hoje e convidou uns amigos nossos pra vir aqui comer. E o mais incrível de tudo é que agora a gente pode fazer esse tipo de vídeo do conforto do nosso lar. Porque agora tem o Marvin Doraí, que é um site e um aplicativo também, que dá pra você pedir comida brasileira em casa aqui em Dublin. Não só brasileira, claro, você pode pedir todos os tipos de comida do mundo que você imaginar. Mas olha que que é isso, gente. Poder pedir coxinha, pizza, pastel, tudo em casa, no conforto do lar. É maravilhoso. Então vamos lá fazer esse pedido no Marvin e vamos ver o que, que os nossos amigos acharam das nossas pizzas. Entrei no site do Marvin, tô aqui na casa da Chaizinha, no centro. Vou então, por aqui que eu tô na Bolton Street. E vou ver o que, que eles têm por aqui. Incrível! Ai, que maravilha! Uhul! Nossa encomenda incrível! Chegou! Bro, I don't know. I understand any of that Portuguese. What the hell? I have... You know some... Alright, alright, pause the video going off topic you know like for you brazilians who aren't great in english but sort of understand a little bit do you some days like have days where you understand everything and then some days where you understand nothing that's like me today today my portuguese brain has gone ciao amigo i don't, I don't know why please come back how do i say i miss you saudade uh, saudade Eu, eu sou da, saudade, saudade, I don't freaking, I'm just talking to myself. <laughs> Jesus. I was gonna say Jesus, then cheese, cheese, yeah. That was that joke, bro. I know this. Is that an egg? What the frick? Hold on a minute. Whoa, 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 whoa. Is that an egg on the pizza? I have never in my life of pizza seen an egg on a pizza. Oh no, I heard about this. Brazilians like dessert pizza a lot. Have I? I don't think I've... I've, I've never had a dessert pizza before. So you think. have some Guaraná in front of you, Guaraná, which is a Brazilian Guaraná. soft drink. Guaraná. It's like our Coke. Guaraná. I already tried it actually. It's, you haven't it's pretty tried? good, it's pretty good. Mm. Just to clear the palate. I smell pear. 1990. <laughs> <laughs> Guaraná. Guaraná. Gua, Guaraná. Have you tried it before? Mm -hmm. I like it. Yeah? Yeah, nice. Yeah, it's pretty yeah. good, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, very sweet. Like, I didn't have pizza until I was about seven or eight years old. Like, it just didn't exist in Ireland. I guess. Really? I knew deals, bro. Bro, um, yeah, this drink everyone wants me to try. And actually, I think there's a site which sells some Brazilian, like, things. I think I'm going to go and buy some and then try it for a video. Because I... Sure, I can get it delivered here. I'm pretty sure. I think it's actually the it's in London like the 
the what you call it the headquarters like i didn't have pizza until i was about seven or eight years old like it just didn't exist in ireland i guess this is my first yeah. experience ever with brazilian cuisine yeah so I, i'm here to prove that uh, irish people can eat everything <laughs> cato frango cato frango yeah that thing is loaded <laughs> that, there's no mess in here the base is base is way thicker than the normal pizza better than how it's gonna be oh yeah yeah. Oh, good first impression. The cheese is like um, between the... There's like a mountain on top of that pizza. Holy moly. The cream cheese and ricotta, to be honest. No, it tastes a bit like this. It's called catopiri. Catopiri. For me, it's a little bit dry. The more you go in, the moister it gets. <laughs> <laughs> I would go again. How is it dry? It looks like an absolute... It looks crazy, bro. Bro, what was I going to say? Honestly, I don't think I have pizza much. I do, I love, I, don't get me wrong, il adoro pizza. But pizza is like probably the most expensive takeaway here, I would say. I, I, I'm pretty sure it is in Brazil as well. I could be wrong. But pizza, I think it's probably the most expensive thing you could order. I'd say like some, pizza, some pay, play, pizza places here are so expensive. It's crazy. Um... But yeah, I do love pizza. When I can have, when I when I want it, I'll try and get it. Pizza is great, and I really want to try Brazilian pizza because damn, this pizza looks absolutely full. Frango com gafiri sounds like a very sounds good. like a commutable disease. Very good for your first time. And that's Sorry, you <laughs> you have a dose of. <laughs> mm -mm -mm -mm. Sounded like what? you said. Really? No. Mm -hmm. I'm completely lost. I'm completely confused. You put olive in pizza. Huh? <laughs> yeah, they do. I think it's right because it's a lot of chicken. <laughs> it's too creamy. <laughs> Look at that. judging like so much. No, it's, I'm not. Like, it's nice. A little bit dry, but not bad. So, do you like it or not? I can't eat anymore. <laughs> oh it's too creamy. <laughs> too fatty, Sophie. Too heavy. Okay, so would you eat it again? Oh. I think I can't. Would you? I'm not sure. I <laughs> this is like bechamel. That was so strange. What? <laughs> I don't even know what just happened in there, bro. Bechamel, like the one in lasagna. That, that's so strange because it's mm -hmm. sweet, you know, kind mm -hmm. of. But the dough itself, it's savory. So it's a good combination. Oh, it's kind of reminds me of like goat's cheese or something like that. No. Yeah, a little bit of goat's cheese. No. Yeah. No. Yes. It's really, really good though. It almost reminds me of dessert. <laughs> like it just looks so light. Yeah, because I'm... The pizza being so dark and cheesy and crucified and stuff like that. But this what, is almost like a yogurt it, pizza. Bro, I don't so think confused. I would have an entire pizza like that. Like, it would be too much for me, I think. it's Just saying. Is that good? Yeah. Pizza? <laughs> Brazilians did tell me that, like, the pizza there is absolutely loaded like there's they like there's they just chuck the whole freaking restaurant on one pizza i mean i'm up to the challenge to to eat a whole brazilian pizza because i love pizza <laughs> pizza is probably one of my favorite things i just wish it wasn't so expensive bro you don't you don't eat pizza with knife and fork in ireland it's nice that is yeah that that <laughs> That is the thing, Brazilians eating pizza with knife and fork. No! That is one thing about Brazilians, one thing about Brazil that I could just never do. Eat. I know even a Brazilian say when they're at home on their self, they do really eat with their hands because, you know, no one's around. Why would you do it? But like eating pizza with knife and fork, I just, I just, no, I just don't really, I don't know about that one, bro. Like just... But then they do say Brazilian pizza is full. It's got so much on top of it. If you tried to pick it up, it would just fall off and you would fail. But I don't know. We'll, we'll see when I come to Brazil. But uh, yeah. Lovely, yeah. Very soft cheese. Yeah, really good. Actually, probably if I eat pizza without knife and fork in a restaurant, everyone's going to look at me and be like, what the frick are you doing, bro? Stop eating with your hands, you freaking... I don't know. <laughs> There's only frango and cheese. The cheese is kind of strange, though. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I mean... I've eaten it also. It's unusual. Different. It's completely different actually. When I get it, 
pizza, mm-hmm. it's usually just pepperoni pizza with salami on it and cheese. I like that. Muito de French. Mm. I liked it, yes. I have to say that <laughs> that exceeded my expectation. Gracias a Deus. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, mm. Calabresa. Mm. Sounds exact. I have the sensation I'm gonna like this one a lot. Calabresa. Calabresa. It reminds me of something, I don't Smell. know what that's like. It's oniony. Yeah. Yeah, we do it with onion. It's called Calabresa Acebolada. I prefer this one over the last one. I prefer the other one. There's something wrong with you. <laughs> <laughs> More um, meat, Calabresa, and mm. less onion mm-hmm. on it. Uh, but yeah, I, I would definitely like. I would onion. eat it again. I would eat it again. Il now gusto onion. I don't like onion. Uh uh-uh. uh. No thanks. Onion? I mean, actually, if you put onion in something to make it a little bit more flavorous, then it's alright, but onion? Oh, not sure about onion. <laughs> yeah. With more of this meat on it. Brazilians love olives on pizza. Now, again, some. Just saying! <laughs> Just saying! Let's give it olives. a try. Olives on pizza? That's crazy. I've never seen that before. I've never seen that in the UK before. I would say that's probably in the UK, pineapple. We love to put pineapple on pizza all the time. I don't know if you guys do that in Brazil, but pineapple, apparently it belongs on pizza. Personally, I don't like pineapple on pizza. God, basically on pizza, I just like meat and cheese. <laughs> all right, let's give it a try. Mm. Do the it's try, getting try. better and better and better. And- Completely yeah. different taste mm. every single time. This is getting closer to what I know and love in a pizza. Cala, calabresa. Calabresa. <laughs> it's a lot of onions. Can I take off onions? Sure. This is nice. Yeah. I love sausages too. Without onions. Yeah. <laughs> and the um, sausage is spicy. This one does. Wait, they are eating it with a knife and fork? No, it's not. But it's good. It looks very healthy. I, I like this one. Yeah? You yeah. like it? Yeah. With onions? Yeah, with onions. Oh, they're not That's Irish, are they? one before. <laughs> Sorry. It does look really good. It looks so good. <laughs> yeah, it's awesome. Mm. Except from the onions. Not sure. Mm. It's really good. Oh, they're all using knife and fork. Okay. What's going on, man? What's going on? Is this just a thing in the UK that... Is, do I eat... It's just a thing in the UK that we eat with our hands. Does everyone else in the world use a knife and fork? I don't know, but that guy in the middle is Irish. Maybe he got asked to use, I don't know, but I know he would normally not use knife and fork. I know that, I know that, because we don't do that in the UK. But this cheese is completely different than the one Yeah, on the first one. Mm-hmm. Crispy base, cheesy, and then some meat on top. So yeah, pretty good for me. For me, this is my second favorite. My completely number one was Number one. I know Calabresa. You have Calabresa in Venezuela? There mm-hmm. we go. I was gonna say, these guys aren't using no knife and fork. <laughs> you're not gonna like the onions, are you? I actually like That right there, what you're seeing here, is how I eat pizza. And I know Brazilians be like, Alfredo, use a knife and fork, man. Oh. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, nice pizza. It's similar to like another sausage from here. Not from here, here. Sausage. Because like, there's, mm-hmm. a, there's a sausage from Poland that's similar. Poland, yeah. I like the other one better. Do you? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, I'll, yeah, the onions are nice in this. <laughs> you don't need to eat the whole thing if you don't want. I ate them already, so it's too late. <laughs> but it is nice, tasty, because it's cooked and you know, like you only get like, I don't like the crunchiness on them. Ready for one more? <laughs> Portuguese. Oh, I'm guessing that means Portuguese. Yes. You precisely. Portuguese. That's strange. Yeah. Why is yeah. it called that? Chicken, no? Yeah, it's chicken as well. Chick- oh, chicken as well. Oh, no chicken. No chicken. It's, it's not chicken. No. What's that? Mushroom. Onion. It's called palmito. It's from the palm trees and it's Pal- typical from Brazil. Palmito. Pal- yes, palmito. <laughs> it looks quite strange. You like palmito? Yeah. yeah. The rest, mm-hmm. too salty. Actually, in my country, we don't have a pomito. Mine neither. You need more of the soft string. Oh, yes, please. <laughs> uh, I guess it's a neck, onion, salami. What is that? Is there peas inside? Yeah, and you guys are talking about pineapple being wrong and you're putting peas in a pizza. You can some spice <laughs> like oregano or whatever. Standards! Where's your standards, people? Here we go. <laughs> this is stressful. This is so stressful. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, that's loud. Mm-hmm. 
It's nice, but I don't know what is it. The it's onion good. slash garlic? Yeah. I know. It's like an onion garlic Brazilian hybrid. Oh yeah. It's called palmito. It comes from the palm trees. Tree. Yeah, because mm. in Ireland we have so many palm trees. I mean, that's just <laughs> obvious. I used to hate that as a kid climbing palm trees and just finding this random stuff like yeah. This thing of the palm is really interesting. I want to try that. That 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 is interesting. Palmito, the palm trees from the palm trees. I think we did react to that in a different video, and I was really interested by it. But yo, this Irish guy in the middle, <laughs> he's funny, bro. Bro, I never seen a palm tree in the UK, bro. Actually, to be fair, I think I have, but they're not like proper palm trees because, bro, we don't have the heat for that. <laughs> we don't have the heat capacity to for palm trees to survive. <laughs> <laughs> like right now it's 16 degrees, which is good. It's hot. For me, it's hot. You in Brazil, it's probably, that's probably freezing. Where's the blanket? Please, I'm gonna freeze to death. But for me, 16 degrees, it's a good day. It's a good day. It's pretty nice. It's pretty nice. Finding this <laughs> random stuff, like, yeah. This thing of the palm is really interesting. Like, I've never tried yeah. it before, Same. but I like the taste. I yeah, different than the first one. The onion makes the difference over there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a bit of everything. Peas, that's a boiled egg, and that's palmito. Yeah, you have palmito in Venezuela. Yeah. <laughs> you have an advantage, cultural yeah. advantage. Go, 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 go. Wait, Try where is she from? <laughs> boiled egg, and that's palmito. Yeah, you have palmito in Venezuela. Oh, she's from Venezuela. That makes sense. That makes sense. Palmito. Yeah. <laughs> you have an advantage, cultural yeah. advantage. Go, 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 go. Try it. Okay, I'm gonna take out the onions. Palmito. I really wanna try this palmito, it interests me. Is that what I said what was egg and that's what palmito is? I mean, deus. Because I already ate my portion of onions today. I never had a pizza with palmito and peas. This is weird. Mm, weird. <laughs> you don't look happy, man. <laughs> it's nice, but it's unusual. The thing is, I, if I saw it on the menu, I'd probably not order it, but it is actually quite nice, so. That is true. It's nice to be able to try it, yeah. Mm -hmm. I think that one is. That's my favorite one, actually, yeah. Really? The yeah, last one? Yeah. Wasn't expecting it. Mm-hmm. Franklin cheese, the Calabresa, and Portuguesa. We actually have in Italy one pizza, which is quite similar. It's called Bismarck. The main flavor is egg, so it's kind of similar. It reminds me a lot of oh, the egg. egg on it. It's different. I have never had an egg in, on pizza, actually, and if I yes. had, it would be an accident, actually. You need, <laughs> you need calzone in your life. But this one is, it's rocking it. Even with the peas and the egg. Yeah. Which leads me on to my next point. Um, this. It's getting funky here. It has an egg on it. So this an egg. It is crazy to see an egg on a pizza. That is pretty damn crazy. I, I've never, ever, ever seen an egg on a pizza. It feels like Brazilians, it, it, it's just like mix it together, but put anything on, tastes nice. Boom. We've got eggs and peas on pizza. I knew deals. Peas as well. Pizza I want to try that. What? I'm going to make my own pizza, pizza now, bro. Is there no pineapple on it, no? <gasps> Video making Brazilian pizza. No, 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 no. I've got to make the brigadeiro first. <laughs> <laughs> Ham, pig, onion, olive, oregano. There's an ingredient in this pizza. There's that is... palm. Yeah, yeah. Mm. it's really Brazilian. This is definitely not my cup of tea. I'm not sure this will be on breakfast one of the days when I am on. <laughs> For me, this is definitely not working all together. So, least favorite. <laughs> this is... Oh. British slang, yeah, our white English lesson. Not my cup of tea means um, you don't like it, basically. It's like, uh, okay, I love Pepsi, but like, let me just use for an example. This Pepsi is not my cup of tea, means I don't like it. I wanna see you using that, bro. Not my cup of tea, means you don't like it. And yeah, I know it's iconic that it says not my cup of tea because everyone says, you know, Britain, cup of tea, tea, everyone drinks tea in England, but you know, it's not my cup of tea. <laughs> This is the least favorite. For you as well, yeah? Yeah, yeah. People in Brazil have pizza for everything, I think. Even breakfast, snack, yeah. lunch, dinner. Chocolate and strawberry pizza. <gasps> it's oh. round, my! It's very round! But we do it. Nice! Do you like that? Yeah, yeah I you need, like, like now. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Mm. I can have yours too. I like it. All right, you, you can no, have a bit more just to make sure. <laughs> it's just a weird combination. I, I knew I knew you'd like it. <laughs> no, no, you yeah. know your thing, right? Half Portuguesa and half, <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> half uh, chocolate strawberry. I need to be. Are you gonna keep recording this? She oh, really likes that. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, I'm sure I would like this one. Freaking 
dessert pizza, bro. How could you not like that? How could you physically, mentally not like that, bro? This one looks so nice. Willing to try it as soon as possible. Is it like... Um... Sex on pizza? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is my number one, and I have not tested it. I love this guy, man. This is definitely my number one. Oh, hallelujah. Oh. That's weird. Chop it in pizza oh, in one slice. Bro, what? I'm sorry, this guy is an absolute legend, bro. <laughs> I love this guy. I, like, I guess this is gonna be a heaven. In Brazil, I hope you guys have, like, good dental care. <laughs> like, I hope, because I don't know how you haven't lost your teeth by the age of, like, two. <laughs> bro, Brazilians brush their teeth a lot. Don't worry, bro. <laughs> Brazilians like to brush their teeth, bro. Uh, yeah, this is what I've learned. They brush their teeth a lot more than us. In the UK, we brush twice a day. In Brazil, you brush, I think, I don't actually know how many times, but I just know you guys brush a lot. Maybe like three or four, maybe? I don't know, I can't actually remember. But yeah, Brazilians, Brazilians brush a lot more than us, bro. Two years old. A uh, little, little child, little child, have some, have some strawberry. <laughs> That's nice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't think this is a pizza. So kind of like a crepe style. Crepe. 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 Ah. So you don't have crepe. sweet pizza in Korea. No. And in Italy. We do. You do. We Nutella. Only we Nutella. My teeth is melting. <laughs> It's not like a crepe. A crepe is like, like folded over. That's a pizza. <laughs> Too sweet. If heaven lives to my expectations, this is heaven. That was, that was, I was impressed by that actually. I kind of weeped a little bit. It was like, ooh, ooh. I'm a little crying. I don't know. I'm actually surprised because I I've never try tried that the so much. pizza in Italy. Like, although we sell it, it was like, I always thought that it had never been my thing. So I was like, ah. But this is actually really good too. How could chocolate on a pizza not be your thing? Yeah, if you had told me like a few years <laughs> That's ago. That's literally what I was, how could you, how could you literally not like this bro? I don't get how you could not like that. Li you've literally got pizza and chocolate together. Brazil, I need to try your dessert pizza bro. I feel like I'm gonna come and raid your pizza shops and eat it all. <laughs> you know that I'd be eating chocolate pizza. Actually, any Irish person. If I go home now and say, oh, I'm having like chocolate on pizza, they'd be like, <laughs> <laughs> chocolate and strawberries. Yes, on pizza. yeah, very strange. Yeah. Kudos, Brazil. You had a lot of time thinking about your pizzas. You, you, you've really put everything on the pizza, yeah. I like sweet things. The topping this works. Would, this would be strange in the UK, like that Irish guy just said. But honestly, I feel like this is something I would try. I'm probably going to try and do this now, bro. <laughs> just go order a plain pizza, then just put chocolate and strawberries on it, bro. It's a good idea. I'm gonna do that. <laughs> it should now be together. I like the topping. Okay, now let's go. You know that now you can order Brazilian food with the with Marvin Marvin Oh, Marvin oh. Mm -hmm. uh, Where can I go about this? Uh, has he got an app? Is there an app or? There's an app and there's a website. Ooh. Mm -hmm. That's great. And after your video goes live, you're gonna have a code and you can get a discount. <gasps> when you order. Oh. What's the name again, Dad? Marvin. Loads and loads of. Wait, <laughs> is that I? Is that just in Ireland or can I use that in England? Marvin.ie, because I could actually use this to order my Brazilian food. I meu Deus. I'm gonna. Have, I, I feel like it might only be for in Ireland, but I will check it out in case. <laughs> Inside my house. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Perks of the job. Yeah. Oh, obrigado. De nada. Obrigado. Obrigado. I I know, why would it just be in Ireland? Of course it would, it would, yeah, sure, okay. I think I found what I'm gonna use to order my Brazilian food, guys. Bye. Yeah. yeah. Muito bem, lindezas. Espero que vocês tenham gostado. Okay, that's it. Okay, that was very, very interesting to see Brazilian pizza and Gringo's reactions to Brazilian pizza. I think overall we can say that Brazilians like to put a lot of interesting combinations onto pizzas that Gringo's find a little bit strange. But uh, yeah, I'm a strange guy, so I feel like I would really, really like these combinations, especially the chocolate and strawberries pizza. That is something that I would love to try. Looks very, very interessante. But uh, yeah, anyway, I honestly can't wait to try Brazilian pizza for myself, and I think I might be able to because Marvin.ie, I'm guessing it will, I'll be able to order in, the, in England. I'm not sure. I'm hoping. Maybe it's just an Irish company. I'm not sure. Hope I'm praying right now that it's not, but 
If it is, then I'll just find another one. But yeah, anyway, if you like more reactions like this, and if you'd like to see me trying Brazilian food, I should like and subscribe. And ciao.